got uh, this. This here's a Filipino papaya, and then that's like a giant Indian papaya. This is a Caribbean papaya. These papayas are Filipino papayas, as well as these. Really sweet, nice flavor, and then got these uh, coconuts here this is what it looks like inside nice thick meat in there the juice is really good this one's uh, semi sprouted when I chopped it I noticed that in the fridge got a bunch of cameos or balimbi you know same thing these are nice size too, they're quite large. And then I got a persimmon from Texas. It's a, I don't know what kind it is, but it's from Texas. A friend of mine brought them for me from Texas. And then these are, uh, I picked these Balimbe or Camius in um, a friend's yard. This tree was loaded. I also got a June plum here and uh, probably gonna run out of these soon. Yeah, mangoes or June plum season is pretty much almost not, I don't know. Some people have them all the time, but the June plum season is uh, slowing down around here and um, Gotta freeze some. This is some bananas from. These are actually, I think these are dwarf cabin dishes. And then these are Grand Nain bananas. That this, this one, this one, and this one is the Grand Nain. I think. And then this is the. I think this is the dwarf cabin dish. Yeah, tastes like it. But I freeze fruit, so I always have it. And I got mangoes still, even though it's mango season's over. Got mangoes frozen. And I just drooled and spit all over the phone with banana juice. But this is a persimmon, Florida persimmon, frozen. Mmm. So good. Mm. That's what piece of banana. Mm. Banana persimmon. Tastes so good.